Aloha! Top of the morning, friends and family. Uh, welcome to the channel. Welcome back to the channel. We got some cool stuff for you today, but before we get into it, I just want to tell you guys, this is the first time on the channel, we always put out beautifully crafted and edited cinematic masterpieces. But today's video... Oh, sorry about that, bud. It's uncut. And in today's Uncut, we got some cool stuff for you. I just got back from a trip, so it's a little messy in here. Please pardon our dust. Um, got a clutch has been laid from our Cinnamon Sunset female Bridget. And at the same time, on the same day, which also happens to be my cousin's birthday, we seem to have a lot of clutches lay and hatch on family members' birthdays around here, which is pretty sweet. We also have our first clutch of the season hatching, so that's pretty cool. Think about that, boy. I think First it's clutch of the season or year. Season and year. I think it's awesome. <laughs> I think it's awesome too. So, what should we do first? Should we look at the e eggs that are hatching first, or should we take the eggs from the mom and put them in the incubator tub? Um, the I eggs that are hatching first. Yeah. What? Egg Eggs that are hatching first, we both agree on that. Okay, so let me just tell you guys something about the uh, mom, since we're doing the eggs that are hatching first. The eggs that are hatching, no, the mom of the clutch we're going to pull, since I was on a trip, this is the first time I've not caught a clutch like the same day it was laid. So mom's had a chance to recuperate, so she's probably be a little bit more defensive and have her energy back to be defensive. And then she, uh, any other clutch I've ever pulled, which is not a big deal, it's just a ball python, so it's not like it's going to, you know, it's not, not talking about a retake clutch or something. A little more high risk than that. But uh, the clutch that is hatching is the one where we were doing, bless you, is the one we were doing our giveaway contest thing earlier. And we still have to wait for more of them to hatch. It looks like only two of them have pipped out so far, but once these guys are fully um, hatched and shed, bless you, we will do a update on them. And so our winners, we can do a live stream drawing and, and we can figure out who our winner is. It gets to take first or second pick of this clutch. But let's see what we got going on here. Boys, you want to check it out? Or you, what are you guys up to down there? I seem to be a little we're disinterested. Up, we're up to this. Ah, I see. What is that? Star Wars? No, it's my shark monster truck. Shark monster truck. Ooh, he's picking his little All right, so we got two. We got one little hoop slice right there, popping the little head out. And everything in this clutch, again, um, if you haven't been paying attention or if you didn't watch the other videos, this is a... Hypo Pinstripe, our first ball python ever, to our GHI Hypo Spider Girl. So, looks like over here, so everything's going to be Hypo, again. And looks like the first one out of the egg over here is a tiny little girl, or a tiny little snake. Come on you out. You want to check? Whoa, what's going on here? Check if it's a boy or a girl? Yeah. I could do that if you want to hold the camera, but I want to <laughs> see what's going on with this snake first. Hey Looks there, like guys. it's probably a uh, hypo spinner, a hypo pinstripe spider, or just a hypo spider. One of the two. It looks like this he's one's got a nice little cut. Too. Little like what's that? What? This one's got a cut too. Yeah, that's the one. That's the egg that she came out of, or he came out of. Here, you uh. hold the camera, and I will uh, check if she's a boy or a girl. Let's see if it's a boy or a girl. Whoa, whoa, whoa! You can hold it steady there, home skillet. What happens if it only has one? If it only has one, what? What happens if it pee-pee knees? Uh, feels boyish, but, you know, it's... A girl! Uh, it looks like a boy to me, my friend. There's a little hemi peens popping out of that. That's definitely a boy. There's no question that that's a boy. It's a little dark, hard to see, but that's a boy. Uh, the other one's still on the egg, so like, here you go, camera boy. You're supposed to like, point at what you're looking at. This guy's over here like, I'm going to point the camera over here and look at the snakes. Come on. I feel you gotta like, be cameraman, you gotta focus on being cameraman duties. Why is that guy not blinking at all? Why is he not blinking? <laughs> he hmm. isn't blinking at all. He's not blinking at all? No. Not even one blink. No. You not a single blink? Eyelids, can, can you think of one reason, Eli, Eli that uh, that snake might not be blinking? Maybe because it doesn't have eyelids? I gave that it could be a good reason. Yeah, that's your fault for giving it away, Noah. Instead of letting somebody who doesn't know. Or, Eli knows. You know that snakes yeah. don't have eyelids, you dong dong. You're just messing around, aren't you? Well, how are they supposed to blink? They don't blink. How yeah. dare them? 
How dare they? They got a clear scale over their island. Hey, no, are you participating in the video? You're going to go talk over to the sign over there. Buddy, you want to come out? Buddy, just come out. Whee! Wow. Okay, so we got two snakes hatching out there. We got another five to go. What is this? What's happening here? <gasps> well, that is crazy feeling. Let me see it. Let me feel though. You know what? I'm gonna. These things feel. Th these two eggs feel like extremely hollow. Like there's not even any. And the th the shells are very thick. Let's. So I'm gonna give a little rip here. I'm gonna do the old Jesse Johnson, Lindy Johnson, Freedom Breeder technique. Egg ripping on these two. Just because, I mean, that egg has like no fluid in it and it's just a snake. So let's give it a little help, shall we? Uh, I guess there was a tiny, oh, there's a tiny bit of fluid. All right, that one's definitely a spinner. So the other one I was saying was a, maybe a spinner. That one was certainly a GHI. Um, so I'm not really showing you guys very well. You can kind of tell in there, there is can a spinner. There's much thinner lines than that GH, the hypo spider over there. Um, I'll have to t tell later if they're GHI or not. This one again, we'll give it a little, just a little. Nice thing about this technique that, that Jesse showed us before on camera is that when you do that, it kind of it leaves it, you know, let it let it go and it goes back closed like that. You don't really bother the snake that much. And that's like, you don't ever get any, um, you don't cut the veins. Like the way you pinch and pull like that, you see there's no blood coming out. Um, I mean, there is a little vein exposed right there, but it's not broken. So it's kind of a clean way to do it. But the other ones that... These other ones feel like they've got a bit more fluid in them, so I'm gonna let them chill. Wait, I just can wanted I see to... the snakey? Yeah, you wanna see the snakey? Yeah. Snakey? Mm -hmm. Right there. Well, I wanna show the people on the camera the snakey. You can see it after we're done filming. This one is a hypo. Again, everything is clutch is hypo. But there you go, Eli. Take a look. Hello, snakey. Hello, snakey. All right. We'll let the rest of them come out on their own. I've got eggshells. Sorry, that was really poor camera work. I was just, it was probably my instant oh, oh, oh. karma for giving Noah uh, <laughs> crap about pointing oh, the camera no. weird direction. I was like, what's going on there? No, what? I've got egg on me. <laughs> oh, wonderful. Just wonderful. All right, put these guys back in the incubator until we got everything else out there. And let's pull this clutch. All right, Noah, are you going to do better cam work than me while I um, pull this clutch? Or are you going to try and pull the clutch? What's happening over there? I feel like you're... Where you at, bud? Come on, help me out. With uncut video, dude. Uncut video. What are you doing over there? I think All right, looks like I got to do this by myself. Take out the snake while holding the camera. Got my crew over here no, slacking. No, are you gonna help me hold the camera? You're just gonna stand there like a I doof. Could. Goodness gracious! Can, can you? We're trying to film a video here, buddy. Are you gonna, are you gonna like look at the lens and see where you're pointing the camera? Look at the look at the screen. Here, Eli, you do it. This guy over here, I don't know what he's doing. He's not taking this very seriously. I'll tell you that. We're trying to get a nice video here for the people. Okay. So. Amy, no. And you can tell she's got a nice clutch. Good job, Eli. And she kicked one out, which is unfortunate. <laughs> um, <we'll>, whoa. <laughs> we will um, obviously still incubate this. You know, I'll, I'll get a candle on this real quick, make sure I got the right side up. It's unfortunate she kicked it out, but maybe she, there's more than she can handle. So let's see what we got here. What's that little colorful spot? Um, it's just a colorful spot. I don't know what to tell you. All right, Mama. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't even think about my finger. Don't think about rolling these eggs. Why is she hissing? Because she's trying to protect her eggs. All right. And don't go for my knee. Oh. Man, they're not sticking together at all. All right, we're going to have to candle all those eggs. But that is one empty snake. Like I said, she finished laying um, yesterday. But we have a beautiful clutch. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Again, another seven egg clutch, just like the last clutch that was just hatching. We got seven eggs in there. So you're gonna have to and uh, they should be, um, you know, we're looking for more inchy cinnamon sunsets out of this clutch because we had, hey, you bring it up here, bud. More inchy cinnamon sunsets because we got an inchy het sunset to this girl, which is cinnamon sunset. So I'm gonna candle those eggs. I'm going to, no, why are you turning the lights off? Why are you just over there trying to sabotage us, home slice? Oh. Yeah, okay, you thought we were gonna candle. We're probably not gonna candle on camera. Just because I'm having a heck of a time I really like wrangling snakes, there, wrangling so. children and all that stuff. Um I guess we could I guess we could candle it on camera. It's just it's just I got a snake running away. Um we need and then you guys probably stole my flashlight too, didn't you? I have a flashlight that was sitting over here in this You could always use your phone. I could use my phone, couldn't I? Except my phone's upstairs and not with me, so that's a butt loader. 
I don't even know what slash like you're talking about. Well, let me put this snake into an enclosure so she doesn't crawl away while I'm thinking. Um, yeah, so if you guys hadn't stole my flashlight, it would be real easy. I could, you know, there's my flashlight right there in the little thing where I always keep it until children steal it. I have Yeah, no flashlight. My little candling flashlight. <sighs> well, I don't know what to tell you guys. You stole my flashlight. Does and your camera have a light on it? No, my cam. Oh, I do have a light over here somewhere, but it's like it's not very good for can. You need a little like pen light to do some really good candling. So, whatever. I can go get some matches. You can go get some matches. You're I gonna mean, candle the eggs with matches. I mean, matches are how you light candles. I, I, I'm a little bless you, Eli. I'm a little blown away that Eli's taking this more seriously than you today. You seem to just want to be a goofball. Oh, you know what? Shout out Dave Dornsife, 3D Reptiles. He was, between him and Jerry Robertson, those two guys, when I was getting ready to hatch my first ball python clutch ever, those guys answered so many questions for me. I'm forever grateful for those gentlemen for doing that. Um, very cool. Yeah, I'm just gonna candle these eggs. We're gonna turn the camera off so I don't so I don't mess it up and I need to find a light. You guys take care of yourselves, take care of each other. Thank you for jumping in and checking us out on this little clutch video. You guys are the one who shook your light. No, I didn't. It's his flashlight. Is that he took it? I remember, Daddy. Did you have a red one? Yeah, I did. <gasps> I had a red one. I had a green one. I had a black one. I had so many flashlights. Oh. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. We're out of here. Aloha. Goodbye. <laughs>